welcome back to the channel. Just leaving the ledge now. And uh, I'm gonna go and see if I can buy uh, one of those little locks, like a hook and eye thing, so I can fasten that board. And I've got four magnets on it now, and it's still flopping over the one that's covered in my drawers, the plastic drawers. So I'm gonna go and see if I can grab one of them from somewhere. Do a little bit of shopping, I fancy uh, fresh ham with mustard or baps. So, yeah, I fancy that. Yeah, I'll see you in a bit. Gotta check that road because the workers come out of there like bloody hell. Yeah, guys, just got back now. I've done some shopping, got some. Uh, yeah, I had me ham butties with mustard. Bloody lovely. I got bread in the end. I didn't buy baps. But I got these little latches. So they just help to secure the drawer just a little bit better. This one wasn't too bad. That one never opens, but it was this one. Kept flopping open, so I stuck one down the side there. I don't know if you can see that. Down the side there. And uh, yeah, doesn't uh, doesn't open. Doesn't open when I drive. I mean, you know, I've already been for a little drive, and yeah, everything stayed exactly as it is. So chuffed. Got them from the range. No, 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 I didn't. Dunelm. Dunelm. I went. I was going to go to the range, but then I thought, oh, I, I got to go to B and M, so I went to Dunelm. Sixty p each. So yeah, I bought two packs. And then I realised there's two in each pack. <laughs> yeah, didn't realise I got back the van and I thought, oh, I've got spares anyway. And then, oh yeah, it also got this. Solely my idea because I got a junk drawer. So I bought a massive, so it's all got its indi individual compartments. Oh, there's one of my little knives. So I've got spoons, uh, coffee spoons, dessert spoons, knives forks and miscellaneous I got like wooden spatulas with tin opener with lighter thing for the cooker should I need it scissors but it's a lot lighter draw now so yeah really chuffed with that yeah it's a pretty good idea of mine <laughs> oh I'm gonna have a coffee anyway I gotta take my daughter for an haircut at uh, half past five and it's half past four now so I got about three quarters of an hour, so I'll get another coffee. Why not? She's been playing ball, so I'm going to stay to that. Knackered. Tired Malinois is an amazing thing, honestly, yeah. Got a horrible feeling I'm going to have to top my water up. Mm, no, it's not too bad. Yeah, I'm glad I'd done that drawer really, put that other big plastic uh, cutlery holder in because it was slowly becoming a junk drawer because it was only half. The one I had in there was really small and I was having to put all my knives, forks and, and big spoons all in one. And then the other side was just becoming junk and then I had space this side which was junk. It was just throw anything in so. I've chucked a lot away. And what I've kept, I've had to put in appropriate places so I know where they are now. So, yeah, didn't realise I had that much stuff in there. <laughs> right, kettle's going to whistle. Oh! I'll get changed in a minute as well. I've been in these clothes now two days. <laughs> yeah. That's how you go. Oh, I've got to change my duvet cover as well because where she's standing up on the bed, she's sort of putting the paw here and it's dirty. It's this bloody weather that bugger off and get dry. Sunny, dry days. Please. <laughs> Hey, yeah, me. 
Oh, so I'm going to drink that, aren't I? Put it over there. Do not touch. That is some more dog food biscuits. It's a full meal, but I add meat to it as well. That needs to go in the boot because I've still got one in here. All her food's in there. So, yeah, getting pretty organised in here now. Getting stuff in places and stuff. Got my toilet in there now, as you know, and I've got uh, all toilet rolls, they're all in there as well. So, everything toiletry, cleaning products, everything are in there, which has freed up a bit more space in there. So, yeah coming together I wish it was like an overnight thing you just click your fingers and it's all done but yeah it's bloody hard work <laughs> yeah and like when we were doing all these building these boxes and stuff and putting the drawers in then when I get to a park up I'm like I've got to tidy the place up before I can even get in here and then got to make the bed and yeah but I'm glad it's done. Really glad it's done now. It's bloody awesome. Oh, I got a paint run there. I meant to sand off, and that's going to annoy me now because I just spotted it. Yes. It's in the dark, that one, anyway, so it doesn't matter. I can't see it. Yeah, gonna go and pick my daughter up now. Take her for a haircut. spend time with her so that's the best part about it as well I wouldn't normally see it on this day so it's just an added bonus and I'm glad to go and pick it up here she is in her scruffs Right, been back a while now, it's 7 o'clock, I dropped my daughter off, she had her hair cut, dropped her back off and that, so yeah, she's happy with it. So we had a trim, but uh, old sleepyhead then. <laughs> right, I'll probably see you a lot now in the morning, because uh, I'm busy for the rest of the night, and uh, yeah, it's just me being busy, going out. <laughs> so I'll take you a lot. No, I won't, I won't take you anywhere, what am I thinking? I'm going on my bloody own. <laughs> I'll see you a lot in the morning. See you in a bit. Good morning. I'm in a lay-by. That one I've been in before by Whittington. <laughs> Dogs just started barking down the road here. All right, don't worry. We're safe. <laughs> Come on. Yeah, in the lay-by. Had a great night's sleep. There was an Arctic up the road here. Uh, there was a, a big coach down the very bottom, so I pulled in in the middle. But, uh, I got my door open the jar, I just boiled the kettle there. I've been up about 15 minutes. She's been to the toilet, so I came back, made a coffee, and uh, yeah, my windows steamed up because of the kettle, but yeah, they're all right now. And I might close the door. It's a bit chilly this morning. I got the diesel heater on, as you can probably hear. But yeah, it's, uh, it was quite chilly this morning. It was only uh, 12 degrees inside here, but it's cold outside in that wind. So I just put it on, give it a half hour, take the chill off. Uh, well, we have coffee. Yeah, that's where we have bloody coffee, isn't it? Yes. She's dead cuddly in the mornings, and that's the only time of the day she is. You try and do this any other day, part of the day, she just wants to play and bite you. But in the mornings, you cuddly, aren't you? Yes. Oh, bloody heck. She's like, I'm always cuddly, Dad. <laughs> right, so I'm going to have this coffee. <laughs> I was going to say, because you all know me. <laughs> it's just. <laughs> Flows out the tongue, no? Yeah. Yeah, I'll see you in a bit.
What are we going to do with you, eh? It's because it's a new area. She just... Uh, well, she has been here once before, but... There's that many smells, and there's about four, five dog walkers gone past me this morning. So, yeah. It's all new smells, and she just, just wants to get out and explore, but... No, it's too bloody cold. Ah, it's not for you. You've got two fur jackets. Two fur jackets on. Your top coat and your undercoat. Yes, fuck it off. These dogs thrive in cold weather because of their coats. So, yeah. I don't thrive in cold weather. <laughs> oh, the hell no. Wait. Yeah, I'm here in the layback. It's a busy road this morning. So, yeah. I'm trying to get it to go to the bloody toilet, it's a nightmare. So, you don't hear any of this traffic at, at night. It was so peaceful. But I don't hear anything anyway. <laughs> So I wouldn't, I wouldn't really know, really. Oh, toilet. Yeah, she could be a bit of a nightmare in the morning. A new place, all she wants to do is sniff everywhere. Rather than just go to the toilet. And, uh, yeah, there's a bin here. That'd be awesome permanent because it's uh, tied in so yeah that's pretty cool that's bloody awesome put me rubbish in there before I go she's a nightmare with the toilet all right we're going back the van I couldn't give a toss she hasn't been again Trying to get her to understand that every time she goes out, it's not play mode. She's got to go to the toilet, so you haven't been twice now, so no, you can wait. Oh, bloody pain girl. Too busy looking for stones for me to throw. And it's not happening no more. You got to learn. Outside is toilet. And I keep saying toilet to her so she understands. When we're away in other places, she's fine because you just go up, you go toilet, she look at you, turn, go, and she goes to the toilet. But in a new area, she's an absolute bloody nightmare. What? What do you want? Huh? No food. Want your breakfast? Yes. Want your breakfast? Oh. She sits like this for ages. I'm barely, barely holding it. <laughs> oh, you're getting comfy. You're getting comfy. You're my girl. Eh, you're my girl. Ah, oh, she's a good girl. When we pull up here or anywhere at night, she has to do a walk of the area to make sure, it's like as if she's making sure it's safe. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Mad she is, honestly. She's so protective at night. Oh, it's... Yeah. Are you saying thank you for feeding you? Hmm? Oh, he just burped. Thank you. Sit. Wood. Wood. Is that nice? Is that food nice? Yes. It's bloody lovely. Give me more. <laughs> right. We're leaving this lay by now. Let's get right here. Yeah, it's been a good one. So. It's a lay-by at the end of the day, isn't it? It's nothing special. But it is a quite a way off the road, so you're not hearing and you're not getting moved by the draft of wagons. So it's alright. 
Right, I'm going to end this one here, guys. And uh, for those of my new subscribers, big thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed, press subscribe. Because I checked on my uh, statistics in the YouTube studio and I'm 50-50. Half of my viewers are not subscribers. So, come on, guys. Help me out. And until uh, the next one. From Sage and Alan. Take care guys, be good, be safe, and as always, enjoy yourself. That's the key, enjoying yourselves. So, take care, till the next one. Bye. Bye!